Right, here we are catching up with the current 3NZ, the CRC machine, Michael Pickens. Michael made uh, New Zealand Sprint Car Champs, it's the one that you really want. How's it been going uh, up to this point this season? Uh, really good with the Sprint Car. Um, yeah, I think every, every race we've run this season we've, we've won other than um, the last one we ran third. Um, so yeah, we're happy with the car, not really doing anything groundbreaking, just the same old, same old. And um, yeah, you know, it's... Um, it's going good, so tonight's just another night, and uh, hopefully the track's wide enough later and, it, and we get some two lanes of racing. You say uh, it's just another night, mate. It's the New Zealand champs. Come on, get amped up. You're an eight-time midget champion. I guess this is, or I guess it is. It's it's uh, calm and nature coming in this one. The mentality. How do you how do you prep for something like this then? Um, I don't. I just it just it's just another night. You know, I, I race so much now that uh, um, you know. I guess I don't get time to. Um, Build up to to any particular event, it, it's um, and it, it's probably a shortfall. And some 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 guys, as they probably build up to something too much and get nervous or whatever, I don't know. But um, yeah, it's just it's just another night, and uh, we'll see what happens at the end of it. I guess uh, a 30 lap final is going to be a bit easier to drive tonight than a 50 lap midget race as you took out the other night for a seventh time. Yeah. Yeah, that no, was, was pretty special, and um, I guess what made it special is that you know that the, the company that we're racing against is the best in the world. So. Um, you know, plus the fact that we torn up a, a couple of cars leading up to that, and um, we started off with the Hassan Raw, and then, um, like I say, we tore up a couple. And nice to get a win after um, all the hard work the guys put in. So, with the um, midget being in full focus, what happens to the sprint car in between? Do you just sort of park it to the side and tinker away on it when the midget's not being worked on? You know, on those nights off sort of thing, or how does the Michael Pickens team sort of prep two cars? Have you got two squads? Um, we've got almost two teams. We sort of cross over a bit. Um, but we, yeah, they basically just pitch in and, and get it done. Uh, we run, we run basically every single night of the year with two cars where we can. Like at Western Springs, we run um, just about every one. We didn't run the uh, sprint car at the 50, um, largely because of, you know the race it was. Um, we didn't need to run the sprint car as such. We we're happy with it and didn't need to tear up before Palmy. So um, other than that, we run it pretty much every night. And the guys just. Uh, they worked their butts off during the year to get two cars turned around. It's a lot of work, and um, man, I, yeah, I sure appreciate. I couldn't do it without them. So uh, when you take out one NZ tonight after the uh, 30 lapper at the end, we're going to see you climbing the fence in front of the uh, main stand there. Oh yeah, I mean, it was, you know, it's a long night. Last lap counts as always. Um, I say that about every meeting, and, and, and that's uh, that's all that matters. I don't I don't care what happens um, other than the last lap. We, that's the only lap we want to lead tonight. So um, yeah, hopefully we can put on a show for the fans and they see some good racing tonight. Awesome, Michael. Hey, uh, all the best for tonight, and we'll catch up during the night. Cool. Thank you. Appreciate it.